Hey everybody, today I want to make a video on how I get 480p and even 1080i running out of my PS2 through SCART. So I hear a lot of people say on forums and websites and Facebook groups that there is no way to get a f anything above a 480i uh, resolution out of your PS2. Well, I'm here to show you that that's not true. So my setup is as follows. I have back here a SCART cable running out of my PS2 into my G-SCART switch. And it has to be in the first slot, which is this one right there. If it's not, if it's in any other slot, for some reason the G-SCART switch doesn't read a signal above 480i with any other um, any other inputs there. So that's uh, the first slot, and it's uh, connected to my BVM here. Okay, and the game I'm going to be using to show all this is. Gran Turismo 4. It's the only game in my library that has 480p and 1080i also. Okay. So I'm letting the menu boot up to show that I actually do have a SCART cable hooked up to the PS2. See right there? Component video out, RGB. All right. Okay, so how you would normally do this if you were to own the game uh, You'd go to home or anywhere where you can access the option menu Select options Okay, so Right now it's on 480i, but I can select progressive and HDTV. So let's start with progressive first. Or better yet, let me show how it looks just normally. I keep thinking circles uh, <laughs> exit. stuff. Okay, so let me go to drive park or driving park. <clears throat> okay, <clears throat> excuse me. All right, so this is um, 480i. See their scan lines present, and uh, yeah, looks pretty good. So 
Let me get out. All right, so here, I'll select 480p now. Okay. Okay, so now here's where I have to turn the sync off. And as you see, it's 480p. So let's, let's see how this looks. Okay, so not really that many scan lines. It's a fuller image, as you can see. And uh, now let's try 1080i. turn the sync on for a sec. Okay, so it's on 480i. For some reason the menus are usually in 480i, but then during the gameplay and these other in-game menus, it's in other resolutions. So as you can see there, that's 1080i. I love this car. It's the Nike 1 2022 car. Uh, I forgot how I got it, but yeah, it's really nice. It's very uh, futuristic. I'm trying to get to like a flat spot where I can just kind of idle for a little bit. So, 1080i on a BVM with a PS2. One thing I really like about this car, by the way, kind of a fun fact, is uh, if you've ever played this game and you know anything about this car, is uh, when you go into first person view, you hear a little something. You hear like a heartbeat. Interesting, right? <laughs> and it gets faster and faster when you uh, when you go faster. And it gets slower when you're idle. Okay, so that's pretty much what I wanted to show everybody. By the way, the cable that I'm using, in, like specifically, is a Sync on Luma RGB SCART cable. I've heard that there's a difference between using this one and a C-Sync. Something about the, the pinout or something in the head of the SCART. I don't remember exactly what it was, but there is a difference between C-Sync and Sync on Luma. And I think these are probably work the best, or so I'm told. Okay, um, hope you guys enjoy the video, and uh, until next time.